All right, so with the 84th pick, the Miami Dolphins, I'm sorry, the L.A. Rams uh, chose uh, Terrell Lewis. I apologize about that. Obviously, they wanted to get a Clay Matthews replacement, uh, Dante Flower as well, because he left. Um, so they needed so they needed some edge rushers there. Um, Terrell Lewis, if he's healthy, if he's 100% healthy, he's a first-round talent. There's no question about it. If he's 100% healthy, he's a first-round talent. Um, the problem, the last couple of years, he couldn't stay healthy. Finally had the season where he did stay healthy, had 11, had 11 tackles for loss, had six and a half sacks. Um, I definitely felt like, you know, he had some inconsistent tape here and there, but he had a lot of quarterback pressures. Um, he went up against some of the best, you know, interior offensive linemen and tackles in the nation, did well against them. Um, I definitely think that he's more of a developmental player. I, he did no question. He's a first round talent. 6'5", 250 pounds, long rangey arms, great speed and great and great speed and great get off speed. But um, he's more developmental, right? He was a little bit more inconsistent with his technique when he was when he was struggling against some of the best tackles there. Um, I definitely think that you know sometimes the pad level is not there sometimes when he's trying to rush. Uh, again, he you know he uses like maybe two or three really moves to try to get after the quarterback, so he doesn't really have a great arsenal of uh, of moves um, when when working against tackles, but he uses a lot of his speed, he uses a lot of his power, and he uses those those limited moves that he has to try to get to the quarterback. And most of the time it does work. He gets there, he puts the pressure, and he, and it definitely affects uh it definitely affects the quarterback. Um, but again, you know, again, if Terrell Lewis stays 100 percent healthy, if he can develop to the player I think he can be, Terrell Lewis is gonna be a dominant player for the next decade because he is a freak athlete. The only problem with him is the injuries and I definitely think that 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 limited experience that he had with Alabama when he was starting um you know I definitely think that it, it it played into a factor of not of not really living up to his potential at the University of Alabama right if he was healthy and if he if he was healthy those last two to three years and if he would have lived up and if he I, he man he would have lived up to the potential there's no question he would have lived up to the potential I just think that limited experience uh really limited his play as far as trying to max out that potential that he had at the University of Alabama. But he can do it at the next level if he can stay 100% healthy. So Rams, I definitely think that this is a, a good pick. You guys need pass rushers. Terrell Lewis is definitely a player in the third round that you can definitely gamble on because he is a first-round talent.